Okay, sorry about that. The train got me all fubbed up. I hit the, push the wrong button. So I think I got it in the same place that I left off at. Um, but before I start it, I want to touch on something that is a epiphany that I had uh, a while back. Uh, and that's about um, choice. Uh, choice demands options. By that I mean that if there was no options to choose from, choice would cease to exist. And if you look at choices, uh, the most simplest choices I can think of, like uh, on or off, up or down, right or left, back and forth, uh, good or bad, heaven or hell, uh, you'll notice that these choices have uh, two things in common. One, there's the choice that you made, and then one other choice that you could have made, the option. Uh, two, they're the opposite of each other. Uh, up or down, good or bad, on or off, heaven or hell, they're, they're the opposite. And uh, which leads me to wonder, since we were born into a world, uh, and a better way to say it, uh, kind of infected with sin, and we're prone to make the wrong choice the first time. You know, that's why we pollute the air and then we try to fix it. And we, uh, you know, genetically modify our food to help promote cancer, diabetes, and all that. And then we try to fix it. Um, that's why we make the wrong choice the first time. Because, basically, uh, we adopt our belief on what we see, which just kind of messes everything up. But, choice being, uh, just having one option to every choice, and the options being the opposite of each other makes me wonder if the monetary system that we use is simply a choice and because we were born into sin or a world infected with sin that there's a better choice and makes me wonder if righteousness is the better choice and understanding choice makes me wonder if sin is the opposite of righteousness Anyway, I'll go ahead and uh, finish playing this. So, you gotta turn on here. Okay, here we go.
fourth dream and I wasn't really planning on uh, sharing it but uh, like I said towards the end of the audio um, I can kind of feel a presence saying just a seat and I kind of knew right then that I was supposed to share it. Um, well, I guess that's it. I uh, in a blanket at the moment. Well, thanks for listening and uh, God bless. Talk to you soon.